Listen to the harmony. It's that something special that we all help to create when we work together. It's called society. It's the power in our communities that Margaret Thatcher could not kill off with her special brand of economics. This is one of the mining valleys in South Wales. It's where Margaret Thatcher's experiment in trench warfare appeared to work. She confronted Britain's mine workers and devastated communities throughout the disunited kingdom. But the people in these valleys proved to Margaret Thatcher that she was wrong to claim that there's no such thing as society. Margaret Thatcher tried to impose a tax on people's heads. She failed, but she triumphed when she privatised public housing. New owners reaped huge profits and deprived future generations of families of the social housing they needed. Today, many people in the Welsh Valleys are clinically depressed. This is the moment, this is the day. Thatcher's showdown with the miners led to the closure of pits throughout Britain. Today, male choirs of the Welsh Valleys are what anthropologists would call survivals from a bygone age. The living testimony of the human spirit, the yearning to create the harmony that unites communities. I bless the day.
It is easy to despair of politics, but we should remember every human being has a soul that nurtures the spirit that reaches for the heavens. In their darkest hours, people raise their voices in unison to announce, we will not be beaten. Mrs. Thatcher was correct to argue that in the welfare state, which protects people from cradle to grave, people had lost the sense of responsibilities that go with their rights. But if we are to challenge the culture of individual entitlement, we need something that eluded Margaret Thatcher. To balance personal rights with responsibilities, we need a new kind of financial system, one that recognised society's right to a unique stream of income. The income that could be used to fund society's obligations. That stream of income is the rents delivered by the services of both nature and by society. There is such a thing as society, but only if we recognise such a thing as society's income. And that's not the revenue from the taxes on your wages. What are you going to do about it? And now the end is near, and so I